Well, we all know that a lot of people in town are biking more for recreation, trying to get exercise, or just merely to get around town. Uh, and there is a big get together tonight for bikers. It's an open house. It's basically a way for you to go check out some of the trails in the Northeast Heights. We have David Romero out there live this morning with details. Good morning, David. Good morning, Liz. Good morning, everybody. You know what? If you are athletes like these guys right here, somebody right there, anybody taking advantage of the bike trails here in town, you're going to want to listen up for this. This is Mr. Austin Wedge. He is the president of Bike ABQ and, of course, legendary Jerry Shear right here, of course, always with his bike. Right off the bat, Austin, you know, this is some good news for people taking advantage of the bike trails now. Correct. Yeah, we're really excited about what the city's doing here, having an open house tonight here at Jerry Klein Park on Louisiana Constitution. I uh, really encourage everyone to come out here, uh, give your support and, and give your feedback on the trail systems that the city's really had in place and that they're continuing to develop. I think they're proposing to develop close to, what, a thousand, uh, square, or a thousand miles of trails here in town. And they're really finalizing their draft and this is just trying to get people's final feedback on the multi-use trails all around town, not just for cyclists but for pedestrians, runners, joggers, you know, everyone around here. And of course, you know, guys, uh, bike safety is very important for anybody, uh, for vehicles sharing the road with bicyclists. But when, when they're on the trail, uh, somebody like uh, Jerry here, who's always taking advantage of them here in town, uh, what does this mean for you, Jerry? Well, I, I find riding on a multi-use trail like the one behind us is, is really pleasant because I'm not confronted with traffic and I can get uh, all over town on these trails so they're safe. Um, I'm also not complicating drivers' lives. You know, it's uh, uh, they don't have to deal with me, and I don't have to deal with them. So we're all safer, and uh, and so as that trail system gets connected up, because some of these trails just sort of end right now, and you kind of look around and go, okay, where do I go next? So ultimately, the goal is to get all those connected up, so we've got uh, miles and miles of loops, so we can we can ride and we can commute and we can you know enjoy a healthy, active lifestyle healthy and active is really critical and so guys I mean this is really going to be good to essentially connect anybody going to the West Mesa and doing whatever they're going to do out there all the way to the foothills essentially right eventually yeah yeah that, that, they just want to create a cohesive trail system around town here uh, you know try to keep the cyclists uh, pedestrians uh, a little bit further away from the cars I know there's been some problems here in the past but uh, yeah, we're, we're really excited about it. We're actually going to have a nice uh, cruiser ride after the event tonight, right after 637. So we encourage you to come out, just cruise for us on a casual ride here on the path right behind us after the meeting tonight. Uh, anyone that has any type of, um, you know, problems with the, current, with the current trails, the bike paths, please come out and, and give your feedback. We're really excited for the event tonight. It should be a good turnout. And keeping everybody happy, healthy, and safe on the bikes. Guys, that's over here at Jerry Klein Park is where it's going to start tonight. And this is over here on Louisiana and Constitution. Let's back to you. All right, for more information about tonight's meeting, go to our website, casa.com.